my family. Now Prince Harry met up with the Prime Minister of Lesotho, Sam Matekane. And my family, in the meeting, Prince Iso was also there. And I must say, I do love how people who are influential, world leaders, are my family meeting up with Prince Harry, the Duke of Sussex. It tells you really that the ongoing smear campaign being waged by the firm, meaning William and Charles, using UK tablets as a weapon against Harry and especially Meghan, that smear campaign is failing. It is failing and my family already, it has failed. It has failed. And people who are my family, influential, powerful, want to be around both Prince Harry and Meghan, the Duke and Duchess of my family, Sussex. Nigeria invited Harry Meghan there and they went there. We've seen Colombia also inviting both Harry and Meghan there and they were happy to go there. And my family, it was amazing to see. And now we are seeing Prince Harry in Lesotho doing remarkable work. My family, both Harry and Meghan are indeed very, very much my family blessed. Now my family, let me read you my family, you know, details about Harry's meeting with my family, the Prime Minister. And I quote, Now Prince Harry, the Duke of Sussex, paid a courtesy visit to the Prime Minister of Lesotho in Maseru on Wednesday. And my family, the press attache at the Prime Minister's office, Mr. Tapelo Mabote, said that Prince Harry's visit to Lesotho comes in as part of his long-standing commitment to the country through Centre Bale. He said that as the country prepares to celebrate its 58 years of independence and 200 years since the founding of our nation, the Prime Minister also extended an invitation to Prince Harry to join in in the My Family festivities. My family. Furthermore, he added that the Prime Minister also highlighted the remarkable work being done in youth empowerment and HIV programs across six districts and encouraged collaboration between Centre Bale and the Sebabatso Initiative for Young Entrepreneurs. Centre Bale has made a significant impact in supporting the country's priorities, especially in skills development, health, nutrition, and climate change. Lesotho will hold a national celebration for the Independence Holiday together with the bicentennial celebrations at the Sesotho Stadium on Friday, my family. You know, and Harry, of course, you know, has been invited to join in on this amazing my family celebration. And not just that, the Prime Minister of Lesotho, Sam Matekane, also has a message he posted, my family, you know, online about uh, Prince Harry. That my family, I want to read out to all of you his message to Prince Harry after meeting Prince Harry. And I quote, and to the public, my family in Lesotho. And I quote, Good morning, fellow citizens. I had the pleasure of welcoming Prince Harry, the Duke of Sussex, back to Lesotho today. His long-standing commitment to our country through Centre Bale is something we deeply appreciate. Centre Bale has made a significant impact in supporting our priorities, especially in skills development, health, nutrition, and climate change. 
as we prepare to celebrate 58 years of independence and 200 years since the founding of our nation, I extended an invitation to Prince Harry to join our festivities. I also highlighted the remarkable work being done in youth empowerment and HIV programs across six districts. Lesotho will always be a second home for Prince Harry and we are forever grateful for his dedication. I hope he enjoys his visit, especially with the communities benefiting from these vital programs. My family said, Prime Minister Sam Matekane, my family, as he welcomed Harry, you know, to my family Lesotho. Now, my family countries are rolling out the red carpet to welcome Harry and Meghan wherever they go. This time, it is Prince Harry, my family, who is visiting Lesotho, and very soon also, he'll go to South Africa. My family, Harry, is a busy man. But tomorrow, my family, is the Independence Day. You know, my family celebrations in Lesotho. So Prince Harry will continue staying in my family, Lesotho, and doing remarkable, remarkable work there. And soon after, Prince Harry will head to, you know, South Africa, my family. Whereby Harry, my family, still will keep on being extremely, extremely busy, my family. You know? My family, I love that uh, wherever Harry goes, he is welcomed. People want to be around him and Megan. And it is amazing to see, really. It is amazing to see. And one of the reasons as to why you'll see UK Media, you know, being so bitter and pissed off is because my family, the more this happens, the more, number one, you can see that my family, Prince Harry, is able to do this without receiving a penny of taxpayer money. My family, without a penny of taxpayer money, Harry is able to do so, so much good, which raises questions about the other members of the royal family who are taxpayer funded and barely do anything like William and Kim Moulton. My family, you know, and that's the question that UK Media and the farm don't want us to have. Don't want the public to ask my family those questions, you know. And my family, I love, you know, what Harry is doing. He's doing remarkably well, my family. He's doing remarkably, remarkably well. And also, what we can see is what I have said, my family. The fact is, this smear campaign that is being waged against Harry Meghan keeps on failing, my family. It's no wonder people want to be around both Harry and Meghan. And my family is amazing to see. It is amazing. And so, so beautiful to see. Now, my family, right now, I want to hear your opinion on what we have just discussed. May God bless Harry, Meganachi, and also Lily Berdana and Doria Brugland. And all of you, members of the squad at home. Hate never wins, love wins, and stay tuned to our next video. Love you also forever, and may God bless you all, my family. So really, to the wonderful people of Lesotho, I hope you... Celebrate your Independence Day and have so much fun, full of joy, full of happiness. And may God bless you all immensely. And my family, thank you so much to the wonderful people of Lesotho, to Prince Aiso, to the Prime Minister of Lesotho, for welcoming Prince Harry with so much open arms and just telling him how much he is loved. Thank you so much. To the wonderful children whose lives have been touched because of the amazing work of Center Bali Charity, my family. Thank you also for reminding Prince Harry how much he is loved. I am sure it means so much to Prince Harry. And my family, so Prince Harry will continue being in Lesotho, whereby tomorrow my family he will, you know, join in and uh, continue celebrating my family the Independence Day of uh, my family Lesotho. Now my family, I believe I have said enough. 
You tell me kindly your thoughts about what we have just discussed. I want to hear your opinion. May God bless you, my family, and stay tuned to our next video. Love you also forever. And may no weapon from us, Harry, Megan, Archie, and also Lily, but Diana, ever prosper. Hello, members of Zesco Family TV. First of all, I want to say thank you for all your support that you give us to our channel. We don't take it for granted that you support this channel. I want to say thank you from the bottom of our hearts for lending out your support and fighting against injustices, supporting Prince Harry and Meghan, showing them love. Love will always triumph over evil, and for that I say thank you. Good will always prevail over bad. Thank you so much for all your support. Thank you so much for joining this community, this amazing community of Zesco Family TV. I love you so much, family, from the bottom of my heart, and I wish you all the best. May you have a great, great day, and I hope that you enjoyed this video and learned a lot, a lot of things. With that and so much more, stay tuned to our next video. Leave a comment below, like, and subscribe. Love you, family, always and forever. Sayonara.